Melissa with MomSimpleLife.com and today we're going to dig out a potato barrel with the kids. So go ahead Robbie, go ahead and take it over. Okay. <coughs> Whoa. You guys ready? Yeah. Go ahead. See the potatoes. Uh, let me get the bucket ready. Uh -oh. Put all the potatoes in the bucket, okay oh, guys? Look at that! Look! Look who guys! See? Oh, it's a little bug. That's okay. Eat potatoes here. Hey guys, get potatoes. Okay. Wow. And don't drop it all the way and set it in nicely. Oop. I'll try to. <laughs> You gotta dig it out. Uh, uh, this one. Here, Where? let me let me dump it. Let me dump it. Two. Okay, Pop's gonna. Okay, Pop's gonna try to get it all out. Okay. Whoa. Oh, he's gonna try. <laughs> Is it coming out? Yeah. yeah. Are you guys excited? of seed potatoes. There are less than a pound of seed potatoes. Seed potatoes. Uh-huh. Oh, wait. There's a whole bunch right there. Okay, you guys want to put all that in the barrel? Or in the bucket, I mean? So this is 75% sawdust. And 25% sand mix. Don't step on it, Daniel. Yeah. Dig it out. Dig out potatoes. Is a big red <laughs> potato. Thanks. No, there's one right by your foot. There's one right behind your foot. Oh, you almost stepped that on little it. potato. Go ahead and stick it in the bucket. Look at Daniel. this one. <laughs> okay, Daniel, put them in the bucket. <laughs> nice job. Well, don't throw them. Put some more here. Okay, well, keep digging. Keep digging Mom. there. Mom, you want to dig? Ooh. Dig, dig, dig. Dig, dig. This one's rock. Mom, this one's rock. Oh. Ten. 
No, uh, be careful, dude. Yeah, try to keep it on the tarp. Tiny potato? Yeah. Look, Mom. Beep, beep, Oh, I try to flip them all over. Look, Mom. Beep, 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 one. Oh, cute. You want to save that one, too? Uh -huh. Yeah. Are you getting hot? Oh, here's another one. Whoa. There you go, Noah. Huh? We don't want to squeeze those. Up, oh, here's some more. Little ones. Now see the little mini ones. Wow, and all of those, there's like no blight on it, they're all good. So that's pretty good. Mom, my hand's burning. Oh, here's some more. Is this the seed? No. I thought the seed was here, I thought it was. My hand's burning. Now imagine. I only planted three seed potatoes about this small. We got a, we got almost a, a bucket. Mom, it's in here. Keep it. Aw, cute. Mom, uh -huh. it. it's in here. Okay, Mom. I just saw one. Good job. What do we got here? Probably about oh. 15 pounds of potatoes. Mm hmm Take a picture of this. Tiny potato. Yeah. Cool. Yeah, I think we got them all. No, I think I flipped them all over. 19.4. 19. 19. Let me try again. Got it. I'm just going to put it on the whole thing. Yep. Sweet. Almost 20 pounds. Yep. Yep. It's not bad. Yeah. It, and we bought less than a pound on seed potatoes. Mm -hmm. So what was that? 20 times my yield? <laughs> Pretty good. 19 times my yield. <laughs> All that seed potatoes cost me 98 cents. <laughs> I died. <laughs> I'm going to go get that other bell. Hey Daniel, hold this potato. That's a big potato, huh? Yeah. Nice. You want to eat it? Yeah. Very nice. Yes, take some more. So, last fall we saw a couple videos on potato barrels and a couple things about potato boxes and how to make it. I didn't really want to make a box because I didn't want to spend that much money on wood and time and effort. So we decided just to do the barrel and we drilled holes all down the side of them. Going all the way down. And then these are two inch holes on the bottom. And as you can see, we drilled a whole bunch. So when I went to go put the 75% sawdust and 25% sand inside, I just put a couple layers of newspaper on the bottom so that it wouldn't fall through at the beginning, knowing that later it will deteriorate. So then we just started with probably a couple inches of sawdust and sand on the bottom, and then I put about less than one pound of seed potato. It cost me 98 cents for per pound. So it cost me 98 cents for all the seed potatoes. I put three in there, and they were really small. And then as they grew higher, I added more sawdust and sand, and then there's the midlighter method where they have the weekly feed. Even though this is not a uh, midlighter method uh, type of barrel, I just use a weekly feed and the same growing medium that they use and put it inside hoping that with the, the sawdust and sand it'll get enough air to grow a lot more potatoes. So basically all the way until the top 
and then as it grew, it just kind of grew over, and then we just saw this plant died, you know, a couple days ago, so I just cut off all the plants, and then waited a couple days, like most people on the internet have said, you need to wait a couple days after it dies for it to harden, so the skin won't be so, so soft and it'll thicken up. So we got, out of less than one pound of seed potatoes, we got 19 and a half pounds. So that's pretty good for having a fun project for the kids, wanting to dig, but it's a lot of waiting. <laughs> so, so like and share and subscribe. And this is Melissa with MomSofaLife.com. Thank you. Bye.